Mr. Jordan. Couldn't we have him reborn? Jonas! Okay, 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 I'm... Jesus Christ, I really hate that. But I'm... I think, um... It's getting worse, Jonas. The sun's coming up soon. I think we're running out of time. Yeah. Um, look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like... just... like, how do I say this? Cause... Okay, I have a time limit for rambling nonsense, so let's pick it up a bit. I just want to say... I just... I think it would have been cool, us living together for... for whatever, senior year. And I'm just... glad I met you, that's all. I'm just glad we met. Well, come on, of course you are, Jonas. I'm, like, thoroughly awesome. <laughs> yeah, right. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. And we're gonna be fine, by the way. There's no... you don't have to put it like... it would have been whatever to live together. We are gonna live together, and you're someday soon gonna eat all the peanut butter, and when I go make a sandwich, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> all right. Okay, I'm gonna- I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight, but... You know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. What concert? It wasn't- you can't call it a concert. It was like an all-day, all-night, like, festival with tents and, like, a hundred bands. I don't care if it had a million bands, Alex. Ashley had stolen her mom's car to go, and I know you say you didn't know that, which, whatever, but... You still knew mom and dad had barred you from going. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. Ugh, seriously, Michael, it was not my fault. And hell, I mean, we would have probably gotten away with it if not for that sobriety checkpoint. Yes, that is definitely the lesson to take from all this. Down with drunk stops. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. But you, you know what I mean. Uh, commit? What the hell does that mean? You're in high school. <laughs> I know, I know. I sound like I'm 40, but I'm just, I don't know. It's gonna be, it's not gonna be casual anymore. It's gonna be a thing, a real thing. That's all, so just get used to her. That's all I'm saying. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the, uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kinda, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. But everybody loved... Everyone loves you here. You're like... I mean, you should hear how the teachers talk about you. I know how they talk about me. It's like, if I don't become a billionaire president, their life has been wasted. I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Just don't put so much pressure on yourself, Michael. Who cares what they think? You're gonna... You're gonna do what you're gonna do. I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. Yes, I will. Uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. You know what he said? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was... I don't know, for him... Huh, that's actually... that's not bad. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Alex? Stop it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went 
bad again? I couldn't get you out of it. We should really... we should get this done, now. I saw... I saw Michael again. I just... I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. No, I just always do the poster. I mean, you get the option, right? The... Is the bomb shelter open? Did it work? I hope it worked. Please tell me it worked. Oh, yeah. It sprung open. But, Rin, wait, seriously. In AP English, all you had to do was make a fake book cover poster at the end of the semester? Yeah, but the trick is you have to claim you're a kinesthetic learner. Who... What? That's what you're talking about right now? How to cheat in AP English? Yeah, that's what we're talking about. It's the end of the damn world, and I want to chat about something normal for our last few breaths. Okay, okay. I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something... broke. I don't know if it was the ghosts or whatever, but... you've been acting like... not you. Ren. No, I just... Well, I'm... sorry. I don't... I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but... can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and... We're running out of time as it is, Nona. Can't we do a photo op if we all, like, survive? No, come on, let's do it. It'll just take a minute. All right, let's take it. Alex, get in here. You're not getting out. <sighs> all right. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So... Make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. <sighs> Listen, Alex. I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's kind of getting worse. You'll be fine, Jonas. Come on, just shake it off. Don't fade on me now. Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Have you heard Is this- Is this a joke? Yeah, it's a... What do you call a man that's short of time? Tim. You call him Tim. <laughs> oh. <sighs> yeah, it's not one of my finest. It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but Wait, do you it's... think it would even have worked? Oh, damn, like it's another if, radio wave if Yugoslavia thing. or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads. No, I think it would have worked. There's enough tons of concrete here to keep them from mutinying out, I think. It's it feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kinda does. Wait, before... Look, if something happens on the other side of this door, just... Don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. Do whatever you have to. Jonas, we're all getting out of here. I mean, look, we're about to fix this in two minutes. Two minutes! This is 
microwave popcorn of a problem. I'm not asking, I'm telling. Look, dream a little dream, buddy. It's not gonna happen, I'm not gonna leave you. Now, let's just get this door open, do what we gotta, and get home. Wait, 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 okay, you know what? There's, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? Okay, if it'll make you feel better, we'll investigate the case of Jonas's mom's weird song before we save our lives. Sounds perfect. It's like breaking or something. Can you... can you fix it? I mean, it's just... It's... it sounds like it's her. Like a recording, or it's just... It's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but... I can kind of hear it. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Do you think it's... like it could be, right? It's just... W with everything that's happened, she could have come here. It's possible. I mean, a lot's happened tonight in this general realm of craziness, so... I'm not gonna rule it out. God, she's, like, so close. You can just... Can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even... I have no clue what's going on, but if you could just help uh, me... Sure, I, I can I can try, I guess. Yeah, because this... I don't know how to get this clearer or whatever. I just can't... I just can't really get this to change or... Uh, Mom, can you... Uh, You know, the truth is, we could have left whenever we wanted. We weren't prisoners of the cave. And why use my friends? Why, why are you switching with them? Why are you doing this? Because it's scary, that's why. Have you ever stared into nothing and moved with it and felt a part in it? It's worse than when we were wilting into atoms. Worse than dying the first time. I can imagine it, okay? You think contemplating annihilation makes you special? What you can imagine is a toddler's toy bag compared to facing real extinction. Don't speak to us of imagination. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. We're not going back. We won't go back. Child, wait your turn. Jonas, are you... 
Are you here? Uh, ghosts? I is that you? Fort Milner and for the soldiers that died. It's all about that. It's not for us. We've twisted our bodies, screeching two inches from your faces for you to, to see us. And you never do. This conversation is meaningless.
design. Jonas! Jonas, where... where are you? Okay, this is... this is gonna be fine. Just work through it. Tell Michael to stay with Clarissa. They like each other a lot. But Michael's dead. How could I even... Oh, wait, what... what's happening? Hello? Are you... Look, is someone there? Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. What is... How is this possible? What's going on? Could have gone better. <sighs> right. Time loop. Tell Michael he should go to school here. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. Oh, hey, I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Wait, I'm... Th this is our house. <laughs> I'm not. I can't play Amnesia Spy Girl right now. Seriously, pretend to snap Ren's neck on your own time. I've been, like, struggling with the stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have, like, a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. Graduation speech, is that what we're talking about? Aw, oh, man, you haven't been listening at all. It's okay, this is really boring. I'm guessing Mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. What? That's great. Congratulations. I, I mean, that that's awesome. <laughs> uh, thank you. Thanks. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni and... Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I've bored you enough. I'm boring. Michael, say it. Come on, you can't take me to the water's edge of an idea here and then not jump in. That's just cruel. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. Listen, here's the... <sighs> you can't tell mom or dad, but Clarissa and I aren't talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and... and just doing our own thing, you know? Oh, Michael, seriously? You'd leave me here all alone with these boring, bland people who... who don't come up with stuff like grocery cart chariot race? You came up with that one, so... You're not really losing out. I'd still visit all the time, so... You know. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and I... Uh, I'm into the idea. I really am. I just... I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your, like, blessing first. So, can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say I'm alright to do this? Michael, honestly, I don't think it matters. Or, or it, it doesn't matter what I think, at least. It matters to me. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them, it feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. 
and match every beer with a water and take classes outside of school. Michael, what is... what's this for? What, what are you doing? This is just... this is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. And I love you, and you're amazing, and that's it. So... I love you too. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, she's waking up. Maybe don't get up immediately. Ugh. Ouch. Is, um... <clears throat> is everyone doing alright? Still, um... Yourselves? Yeah, I think we're all accounted for, right? Yeah, my arm fell asleep. Jonas but... carried you here. Yeah, he said you were heavier than you looked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. The the important thing is whatever you did in the cave, it worked. The tear, the hole, it's fixed. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Or at least they've they've stopped trying to eat our souls. Jonas, what happened to you in the shelter? I was so I just saw you disappear. I didn't I didn't know what to think. What happened? I thought I heard my mom, and when Alex, when we tried to tune into this signal, I was... I don't know what it looked like from your end, but it was like I'd fallen into a memory with my dad. I don't know. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have set us off course or whatever. I think... Jonas, I think that was your dad. Like, it was real. You were back then. That's... I mean, it felt real, so... I don't know. Maybe. When I was under them, I had something like that, too. Did anyone else? Did anyone... I'm sorry, but like, did anyone have dreams or whatever about the past when they were, uh, taken during the night? Um, yeah. Yeah, a few. Just, um, just the one, I think. I saw, um, Michael a, a few times back when we were here on a kind of an accidental trip. So Michael visited you. He crawled out from whatever netherworld swamp he's in and I, I don't think it's like a visit like it's making a, a conscious choice to come mess with you you were just exhaled somewhere time wise yeah i guess the universe doesn't choose to do anything it just does i can't believe everything that happened i just i feel like we should tell everyone we know like go on a freaking book tour but what no are you kidding we have well, we don't have evidence of ghosts, but we know there's a continuation, a, a sort of life after death. This is like the moon landing times a billion. Except no one will believe it. Is this... Rin, didn't you lose a book? Holy crap! This is it! Thank you! I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, or... that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, prom, prom. Prom. I am definitely skipping this one. I'm deferring the crown to that wheelchair girl. Are you going, Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? I guess. I mean, if I find a date, you know. I'm not gonna go stag. I have my dignity. Ben Owens will ask you. Or rather, he's going to ask you unless I physically prevent him. Eh, you can do better. Alright, you know what? It's picture time. Oh my god. Come on. Nona. <sighs> yeah, I guess we should. Tonight's been, um, noteworthy. Noteworthy. That is a way to say it. Yeah, I'd probably say it another way. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Sure. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half the time. Here's good for the, yeah, just here. Like, look. Like, this, here. When I was younger... I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Okay, everyone. Wait, didn't you... Cheese! Before we'd left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. Ren always loved the town, but the island pretty much erased that in one fell swoop. He ended up going to college in California. He was my best friend, but 
I don't know if I'll ever see him again. Nona, I think, is going to some ballet academy somewhere, but I kind of fell out of touch with her, to be honest. Clarissa fled to the East Coast, dropped out of college, and works at a boutique. I hear she's scared of the ocean now. Jonas was the first to introduce me as his sister. You know, without the step part in front of it. And it was weird at first, but it's the truth. He's my brother. He goes to school in town, and we see each other a lot. It's funny, what happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day, and then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's, I don't know, it's good, I think. But anyways, I, um, well, if it matters. I decided to stay in town and go to college here. It's practically up the road, and I just wanted something familiar, I guess. But anyways, oh, what time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Run's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing, and I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. <sighs> I hope he's not weird or mean or something. Whatever, I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right?